Okay, in this whiteboard animation, I'm going to talk about the logical relationship type that is when you're doing your activity scheduling and you're trying to do your sequencing of your various activities. This one is called finish to finish. And the reason it's finish to finish is that you want two activities, no matter how long they are, or many activities even, to all finish at the same time. And that would be the finish to finish relationship. So for instance, I have A, B, and C, and I want to make sure that I can't say that A is done until also B is done and C is done. I cannot call any of these finished because they all must finish in order to be considered finished. For example, uh, let's say we're running a marketing campaign and, and there is um, you know the website that needs to be finished the marketing material the the collateral that is going to be sent to all the press and to our customers and maybe also to um, there is a brochure that needs to be completed and all of these items a B and C have to contain the same copy the same language the same images and so if we have an image on on one that same image needs to be on all three of them and the same text has to be then on all three and if we're not finished with writing that text on a then we can't say B is finished nor C and as such we want to ensure that these three are in fact connected so that we don't accidentally send this off to the printers if it's not ready if it's not finished because we can't assure it to be finished without the others and so when we move the, any of these activities let's say if activity a something before it gets delayed so we're thinking oh we'll just we'll, we'll bump back a well no we can't just bump that back a because actually we might be bumping back all three activities because they are logically connected and so as you are controlling your schedule and you're looking at how things are going you might have to realize or you might need to consider how that's affecting not just activity A but all of those activities that have this logical dependency of finish to finish and so that's one of the four logical relationship types that you need to know in your studying of the PMBOK 6th edition.